and I'm picking up all these things and I have no idea what they do. I'm just picking up things that the enemies drop because... I don't know. I'll figure it out later, I'm sure. Or they'll tell me later. Possibly in the same manner they tell me everything else. He jumps really high. Uh, level up! That was not something exploding me. That's really So, the controls are... I've been used to playing Fallout, which has the Y button that, um... Oh, hello. I don't know where you came from. But it has the Y button that jumps, and in this one, it's not the Y button. It's definitely the A button that jumps. And that threw me off. Picked up more things, I have no idea what they do. Clearly I've missed something here. Ooh. Oh. Hello! Can't get through there. That looks not- Oh! Key! And another wall chicken! Mysterious wall chicken. So I have to go back up here. Oh, where's the key for the other one? I don't even know where the key for the other one is. That's a problem. Okay, let's open this. Oh, X. A. A. Well, thank you for explaining that to me, game. That was quite helpful. Quite very helpful. So where did the other key go for the other one? Did I just not find it? Oh! They respawn! Monsters respawn! Oh, get back here. Apparently, monsters respawn. Go back to the savey thing. I have no idea where the key could be. And that's definitely a small issue. Because I've already been here and through. Oh, more monsters. Also, I'm collecting all these coins, and I don't know what the coins do. this key could be. I'm going to assume the key is probably on the same level as the chest, as that was what was with the last one. That might not be entirely true. 
I just got blasted by a level up. met monsters. There are no monsters here now. But there are monsters here. And there's a hole here. Sure, how to get through that hole. I don't know if that's just a bunny hole or what. there's rain. This is really going to mess with my uh, gameplay. implies that you can go downward. However, I have yet to find a way to go down. Also, I think this is where I started. Oh, there's a key. Well, I found the key. The key was back where I started. And now all the monsters are back. Most tutorials will walk you to the first key. Not this one. This one does every other cliche tutorial thing. Except for that. It doesn't even tell me why I'm collecting coins. Because it seems like a good idea, I guess. And I assume the flag on the little map that I'm following uh, refers to something. The, f the finish line of this, this area, which is where I'll end this, at the finish line. But first I've got to go get that treasure and beat all the monsters. No escape. Okay, so there's no escape. Apparently that's what the red thing means. Oh, I'll get the treasure. B, X, X. No, more treasure. I don't even know what I've got. Tasty cupcakes. Mysterious wall chickens. Load of nuts. Okay. I have a revival stone. I have no idea what that does.
Material shop. I guess this is all the materials I have to make things? Quests. Map. Inventory again. Well, it tells me nothing. I'm, I'm going to assume that maybe it'll tell me later. Which, of course, is, is logical to assume, I guess. No monsters respawned here. But it's going to save me. And since I already got the chest in this area, I can just beat the monsters all up. fuzzy little critters that are running around like the rabbits and the deer however if I were a rabbit I definitely would not be um, playing around in this environment it seems a little monstery to me and that rain went away really fast I mean granted I'm from Michigan and living in Wales currently but even for me that rain went away really fast but hey, nobody likes rain. And now it's back. The old wives' tale in Michigan is, uh, you don't like the weather, wait five minutes. And that's exactly what we just did. Get some more monster materials. And another blueprint. A filthy pendant. Why would I want a filthy pendant? I would rather much have a clean pendant. So, how do you make these? I don't know. Um, I assume you have to be someplace like a forge or workshop or something. I'm, I'm sure it'll tell me later in the game, as it's told me everything else! Pressing it a little, trying to get all the information out at the beginning of the game, but and the red thing disappeared, so I think that's it. Uh, treasure? There's a treasure chest around here. Wow, it's really beautiful up here. Yeah. So I don't even know who I am. How am I supposed I was to know? Maybe hoping you could tell me. Silly me. I seem to have dropped all my detailed maps and navigational equipment chasing after a crazy flying sword. That's hardly my fault. I'm sorry I got you mixed up in this fidget. Again, hardly my well, fault. Well, you should be. Digging me sword, getting me in trouble. You know, now that I think about it, this isn't the first time I've seen this view. I've stood here before, in this very spot. Then perhaps you recognize the village at the base of these cliffs? No. It's hard to make out from here. We'll need to drop down to the valley floor if we want to get any closer. Very well. Proceed as you wish, Dust. Oh, thank you. 
magical talking sword. Oh, I have a quest update. You... There is a village in the distance. Perhaps it holds some answers. Leap of faith. They chased and I ran. Five, maybe six of them. All armed to teeth and closing in fast. I made it to Archer's Pass, but with an arrow in my leg and they caught up with me at the headless statue. Surrounded, desperate, and nowhere else to go, I climbed out to the hand and made a leap of faith. Well...